This is Dr. Daniel Paul, orthopedic surgeon with Easy Orthopedics, and today I'm going to answer how do you know if you strained a muscle? Well, if you strain a muscle, it usually most of the time hurts, so if you don't have any pain, you probably didn't strain a muscle. You may get some swelling and some redness, um, and that's the basic way you know that you strained a muscle. Now, the question is, how do you know if you didn't tear it? Well, if you tore a muscle, you may have start to have some disability with moving around and everything like that. Muscle strains are much more common than muscle tears. Um, and then it's just more of the same. So if you strained a muscle, you may have some redness and some swelling and some bruising. You know, if you, if you tore a muscle, it's like all that, but much worse and to the point where you may have significant disability moving around. Um, also what comes into question is muscle soreness. How do you tell the difference between muscle soreness and a muscle strain? Well, a muscle strain, the pain will come on right away, right after you hurt it, essentially. So if you're running and you strain your hamstring, it hurts right away. While muscle soreness takes a day or two to develop, so let's say you're running and you know a couple of days later, then your hamstring may hurt. So that's the difference between muscle soreness and a muscle strain. And like I said, a muscle tear is just a muscle strain. It feels like a muscle strain, but just much worse. Um, so what do you do about a muscle strain? Well, the best thing to do is to avoid the activities that caused it and you also want to use anti-inflammatories, ice it, and elevate it. Um, and most of the time with resting and those activities, it will really go away on its own. If you keep straining the same muscle over and over again, then you probably have some sort of biomechanical issue. Like let's say, you know, maybe your hamstrings are too tight or your quadriceps and your, and your hamstring aren't quite in balance. Then you may want to do some physical therapy to kind of make sure that you fix that biomechanical issue so you don't keep straining it. Well, that's pretty much all there is to it. So I hope I was able to answer your questions about how do you tell if you have a muscle strain uh, as compared to muscle soreness or a muscle tear. Um, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to leave them in the comments below and I'll do my best to respond. Um, if you like this video, we put out new content every Friday, so please like and subscribe and thanks for watching.